Hi everyone, Jeanette Byro here. I'm a medium and a channeler. Interesting thing I wanted to mention. So we have been going through a lot of like dark night of the soul and shadow work. That's another common term a lot of people talk about. Going through triggers and pain and trauma and, and I'm not making light of that and why I'm bringing this up. Here's an interesting thing though. A lot of people can mistake hauntings or demon activity or something for actually aspects of their soul self that are unhealed. And now if we're talking about something that's like shaking things, uh, you know, things flying off your shelves, most likely that's not a soul aspect of self. And then that's also not a very common thing. I'm talking about the things that feel like something is lurking behind you, the things that trigger a total fear response within you. Um, things like that are often pieces of either past life soul fragments or even this uh, current life soul aspects of you that are still in the energy of hurt, pain, trauma, and so on. So the whole point of why I'm bringing this up is when you face the things that scare you, and again, this is general, I know there are unique cases of different things, but generally, when you face the things that scare you, you're facing aspects of self that need healing or need to come to completion or come full circle. So something to consider. So the next time you feel like something is haunting you or um, an idea is kind of haunting you or whatever the feeling, sensation, whatever it is, look inside and see what is that actually haunting you about? Like what is, what is the root of that fear? Because you're gonna have the fear response, but then it's about getting to the root of what it is and the root of that may very well help you heal an aspect in yourself. And the great thing is, is once you do that, you're no longer triggered by the fear, right? It's a really neat thing. So something to consider moving forward and another way to look at your figures and tr uh, your figures, your fears and triggers as you move forward. It might help you gain some freedom. So hope that helps and I'll be back with more.